Inside the YouTube sensation, Emma Chamberlain's stunning new home. So let's check this out. So it's picture in YouTube perfect. YouTuber Emma Chamberlain has opened up her gorgeous home to Architectural Digest, or AD, showing off the dazzling surroundings in which she lives. So the internet sensation who boasts 11.8 million followers on YouTube alone purchased a five-bedroom, seven-bathroom California house in June 2021 for $4.3 million, spanning more than 4,440 square feet. Chamberlain, 21, spent the past year renovating the home to her liking. Standing in the mountains above Beverly Hills, Chamberlain designed the home as a chill, laid-back vibe, with luxury in mind, A.D. explains, adding that it provides an earthy with a twist ambience. I work from home, so I wanted to create something completely personal and comfortable, Chamberlain took the magazine. I brought in references from many decades and design eras, and I try to meld them into something that feels not only cohesive, but new. It wasn't about following the rules or sticking to one aesthetic. I tried to approach it all with a lightheartedness and an open mind. And the thing is, I mean, it actually looks pretty nice, right? Okay, now how the hell do you get back? Eesh. Okay. To the newly designed living room with skylight windows on the roof. Looks pretty nice. A sitting nook in the living room with floor to ceiling windows. I gotta say, the floor to ceiling windows is a pretty awesome thing. The kitchen before renovations. So the newly designed kitchen. Emma Chamberlain says she was inspired when she saw a green kitchen a few years ago, likely referring to Dakota Johnson's home. Now, I don't know about the green for the kitchen. Like, the, the cool thing about her house is that it feels very bright, right? It feels very light, like lighthearted in a way. But the thing that kind of makes me wonder is, like, how much did this cost to, like, renovate? Because this is probably, like, multiple six figures to renovate. So, built in 1955, Chamberlain said the home had a summer camp feel when she bought it, which led her to lead with that theme. The residence was designed in collaboration with Ashley Drost and Mary Trollman of Prom Studio. We described it as wet, hot American summer meets troop Beverly Hills, she said. I'm a mood board type of girl. Have no clue what that is. I scoured every corner on the internet, every weird deep hole on Pinterest, she added. I find inspiration for the home everywhere, the same as fashion. It's all one in my mind. By the way, I, I have literally no idea what a mood board is. Let's see. The den, one of five bedrooms. I like how simple the bedrooms look. Interesting. I wonder if there's any comments. Okay, yeah. So what does this person do exactly? I believe she's um, mainly like a vlogger, I think. Yeah, YouTube video blogger. I try to watch one. Don't get it. Fantastic. I guess it's more about like personality. Maybe people just really love her personality or something like that. Which is all cool and dandy. Feel free to give your thoughts. I mean, I think it's a pretty nice looking house. Just I think it's probably overpriced. <laughs>